Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. If you are, my name is Jay Monet. Thank you so much for tuning in today. So today's video is going to be another monthly favorites video. You guys really enjoyed the last one, so I decided to do another one for this past month. So I'm gonna start off my monthly favorites with my top picks from Dossier from this past month. If you guys aren't familiar with Dossier, they're an inspired by fragrance company, meaning that they create fragrances inspired by designer and niche fragrances for a fraction of the price. So since it's still really hot, I wanted to share with you guys some really great fragrances for the summer. They're very light and crisp and fresh. The first one that I wanted to share with you guys is Dossier's Citrus Green Apple and it is inspired by light blue. The green apple and lime are definitely prominent notes. It's a very fruity fragrance. It's very crisp, it smells fresh. I mean, it's a citrus green apple. Like, it literally smells exactly how you would imagine it to smell. It's definitely more of a daytime fragrance, in my opinion, but um, it's definitely a staple for the summertime. The next one that I wanted to share with you guys, I'm sharing this as a summer fragrance because I do feel like it is very fresh and light, and it's something that isn't offensive um, in the heat, but it also is just a really great signature fragrance in my opinion. So this is their Floral Grapefruit. And this one is inspired by Chanel Chance. The difference I would say between this one and the other one that I talked about, they both have top notes of citrus, middle notes of floral and base notes of like musk, but I feel like this one is a lot more floral than the other one. I'm not, I, I the other one had rose, but I'm not getting the rose at all. Um, this one, you can definitely smell the jasmine, the lilac. It's definitely a lot more floral. I think this is also a daytime scent, but it could be more of a nighttime scent. I think more so than the other one. And like I said, it's a good signature scent. You could wear it to the office. It's not offensive. It's light, it's crisp, it smells like clean and fresh. And so that's why I, went, I thought it was a really good um, fragrance for summertime. So continuing on with fragrances for summertime, I have been loving the Sol de Janeiro. This is just their original fragrance. And I have it in the um, Bum Bum Body Scrub and the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. It smells so good. Like I would say that the difference is this is also a summery fragrance, but this is leaning more gourmand and very sweet. I'll put the notes on the screen as well, but it's definitely leaning more on the tropical, gourmand, nutty, it's like creamy, rich. It smells so good. I'll probably continue to use these um, throughout the summer until they run out, and then obviously, you know, for fall, I'll have to find like a different duo, but. This is literally my go-to right now. Okay, so continuing on with the fragrances because I'm a, like I have an addiction, honestly. Um, so this one is actually a perfume oil and this is by Nest and it's their Indian Jasmine. If you love Jasmine, you'll definitely love this. Again, I'll put the notes up here so that you guys can see what it smells like. I believe it has like fruity notes as well, like berry. I think maybe like red berries. I could be wrong. Like I said, I'll put the notes up here. It's a really yummy daytime fragrance in my opinion. It's floral and fruity and it just smells really good. It's very feminine. So yes, if you guys love Jasmine, try it out. Let me know what you think. Okay, we're finally moving on from fragrances. Um, I wanted to show you guys what I've been using on my hair lately because it is just a game changer for me. So I've been using the whole Olaplex system. Literally, I pretty much use, I don't have every single step, but the ones that I use are the, let me see. I start off with the Olaplex number three. I don't know if you guys know, but I recently chopped all of my hair off. <laughs> um, yeah, maybe I'll post a picture right here so you guys can see like I'm literally starting from scratch um, I think I cut it in February, which is why I've been wearing my hair in braids uh, Because I'm trying to grow it back out and I really am focusing on 
the health of my hair. I feel like I've never really cared before. I just would just do whatever to it, but I really wanted to invest in this system because I know it's really good for damaged hair. So I also have in the number eight, and I could be wrong, but I believe that this is one of their newer ones. And you can use, if this is their Bond Intense Moisture Mask. Oftentimes I will use this one in conjunction with number three, or you can use it after you wash your hair, it doesn't matter. And then I have the number five, which is the Bond Maintenance Conditioner. But let me tell you guys, once you get to the conditioner step, your hair is gonna be so soft. It's like, you know how when you have conditioner in your hair and it just slips, and like your hair is just so like soft, and then you sometimes you rinse it out and then it just goes back to the state of being like it doesn't feel as soft anymore. This stuff, like I will literally be in the shower, like trying to get make sure that it's all out because it just literally feels like it's still in my hair. Like that's how soft it is. Um, this one, the last one is the number six, and this is the bond smoother. So this one is a leave-in treatment, it speeds up the blow-drying time. It's really good for flyaways and like frizzy hair. The whole Olaplex system is amazing. And if you're like me and you're trying to focus on the health of your hair, um, I definitely recommend it 100%. Or if you like your hair is dyed, if you dye your hair, um, again, use this system. It's specifically made for damage and color treated hair. So highly, highly recommend. So as I mentioned, I cut my hair really really short <laughs> a couple of months ago and um, I have been I just want to share the vitamins that I've been using to grow it out I wish that I had a photo of my hair now but I can finally get it in a ponytail so I mean that's some sort of progress I'm really impatient but these vitamins have helped tremendously so this is the um, JS health hair and energy vitamins I would say go to their Instagram page and look at the before and afters. It is almost like unbelievable. After you finish one bottle of these, you will see a noticeable difference. Like I would say if you get these, take a picture of your hair on the first day and then take a picture of your hair at the end of the bottle and I guarantee you, you will see a difference. It's like insane. Okay, now moving on to my beauty favorites. We're gonna start off with my favorite, hands down, my favorite beauty favorite right now. This product really changed my skin um, in ways that I never thought. For one, really quickly, and for two, it really has helped so much with my confidence. So this is the Ole Hendrickson Glow 2O Dark Spot Toner. This is what it looks like. I've heard so many great things about this product. Um, but now that I'm actually using it, I can vouch 100% that this product is amazing. For the first time in years, like literally years, I feel comfortable leaving the house without any makeup on. I go to work without any makeup on sometimes. Um, if you guys have, I know you guys are sick of hearing about my acne journey. I talk about it in like every video at this point, but now that my skin has finally cleared up. I needed to target those acne scars. They were really bad, you guys. Like, really, really bad. I will show, actually, you know what? I'll do before and afters here and here so that you guys can see how bad my acne scars were and then where we're at now. It's night and day. Like, it is, in, it blows my mind. And as you guys can see, like, I haven't used that much of it. I just got this product last month. Game changer, you guys. If you guys are struggling with hyperpigmentation, you need this product. Thank you later. Okay, so moving on, this is a product that I've had for so long, but I obviously have been using it again now that it's summertime, and that is the Glossier Future Dew. Um, it's a serum, it's, you apply it, I believe, you might be able to use it as, um, Okay, yeah, so it says apply two pumps all over your face as the last step in your in your skincare routine. I personally only put it in areas where I would apply highlighters. I like my makeup products to be more on the matte side just because I do have oily skin, but I like to put this on so that it's not super like powdery looking. It gives it more of like a natural glowy sort of look, like more skin-like in my opinion. It looks like this and it just kind of goes on I don't know if you guys can really tell. As you guys can see, it just gives you that natural 
glow, like a natural highlight. And like I said, if you have oily skin like me, just apply it where you would apply your highlighter and it's just, it just makes my skin look a lot more like healthy, if that makes sense. All right, so the last product that I wanna share with you guys is also, I don't even know how I found this product. I think I might've found it on a YouTube video. So I got this product to basically use after shaving. Anywhere that you shave that you might get like hyperpigmentation or razor bumps, this product is like amazing. The only thing that I will say is that it makes your skin peel. So maybe it's something that going into fall and winter you might wanna consider using because I will say like 100% works. Take that as you may, it works. Just maybe keep in mind that it might cause your skin to flake a little bit. I get laser hair removal, I just started getting it. So um, it's just something that I use after, in between shaving, in between my sessions. I really want to share with you guys because I feel like it's something that a lot of people struggle with and I think you guys will find this product to be really helpful. That pretty much concludes today's video, you guys. I really, really hope that you enjoyed it. Um, if you guys are interested in purchasing these dossier fragrances or any dossier fragrance in general, I will have a coupon code for you right here on the screen so you can get some money off of your purchase. Like if you're interested in expensive like niche fragrances like Le Labo or MFK, they have some Jo Malone fragrances as well. Highly suggest just check out their website, you guys. If you enjoyed this video, definitely don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I will catch you guys in my next video.